This is Empire State Building. It is huge. This is a plastic water bottle. It is relatively very small compared to Empire State Building. For comparison, if the human body is the size of Empire State Building, then, the length of single beard hair grown just the day after clean shave contains 10 plastic bottles. Now that we have established how small a plastic bottle is compared to Empire State Building, I will go further. If we take all the plastic water bottles Americans use daily and stack it, we can build one Empire State Building every 12 days. That is 30 Empire State Buildings a year in U.S. every single second. An estimated 1,500 plastic water bottles are used. Earth is very large. Moon is quarter the size of Earth. Moon is actually not this close to Earth. In fact, Moon is very far from Earth, so far that you can fit 30 Earths between Earth and Moon. This is a map made using only roads in U.S. America has world's largest road network. So large that if we attached roads end to end, we can build road to moon. 28 times. Wondering, what does that have to do with plastic water bottles? You can keep plastic bottles on center of all paved and unpaved roads in America, next to each other. Americans use so many plastic bottles that you can cover the entire distance in just two years, three months. Let's take a simple realistic example. If this is an average human being, then every single second, these many plastic bottles are used in America. This plastic bottle wall is 30 feet high, 10 inch thick, and 20 inch deep. Hypothetically, you can build a 30 feet bottle wall for 1,954 miles between US and Mexico border in just 87 days. Now let's talk about resources required to make a plastic bottle. To make one plastic water bottle, you need one quarter bottle of oil and three times the quantity of water it holds. The energy required to make one plastic water bottle is 2000 times more than the same amount of tap water. Each week, it takes more than 50,000 18-wheeler trucks on our roads just to deliver our bottled water. With the amount of oil needed to manufacture, transport, store and dispose of the plastic water bottles in a single year, we can fuel all the cars in US for two weeks. Doesn't sound much? It is because America has too many cars. Let's quickly talk about air pollution. Air pollution caused by manufacturing five plastic bottles is equivalent to driving a car for one mile. Now if we calculate for all the bottles in a year, it is equivalent to pollution caused by an average passenger car traveling to moon and back 20,000 times. One quick cost comparison. More than 90% of the price that you pay is for the bottle itself. Every time you buy a bottle of water for $1, you are paying more than 2,000 times what you would if you filled that same bottle with tap water. Another way to look at it is that as soon as you buy your first bottle of water, you've already spent double what you would for an entire year of tap water. You must be wondering by now, these plastic bottles will be recycled, right? Yes, of course. Just two or three out of ten bottles will be recycled. After a single use, nearly every bottle either ends up going straight to a landfill or becoming some other sort of plastic. Even the small fraction of bottles that is recycled ends up being downcycled into clothes, carpets, toys, and packaging materials. These items are not recycled. Eventually, they end up in the landfill or will be dumped in oceans, where they will slowly break into smaller and smaller pieces to become microplastics. Researchers tested many bottles from different brands. They dropped a red dye in each, which stuck to the microplastic and glowed when passed under a certain light. Some bottles were so full of plastic that, to count the particles, the researchers called a former astrophysicist, who shared his tactics for counting stars and galaxies in a crowded sky. Microplastics are found in 90% of bottled water. 
Scientists said they found roughly twice as many plastic particles within bottled water compared with their previous study of tap water. A recent study showed that we could be swallowing a credit card's weight in plastic every week. You can change all this. If you share this video to five people, and each of them share to five more people, and so on, within just 12 such iterations, we can spread awareness to entire US population. Just so you know, all the statistics in this video is only for bottled water. In US, 36 bottles of carbonated beverages are sold for every 40 water bottles. And each carbonated beverage plastic bottle weighs three times more than a water bottle. Of all the plastics produced in the United States, plastic bottled water packaging makes up only 0.92%. Water is a necessity of life. Americans are very lucky to live in a country where clean, safe water is available at the turn of a tap. When you have a choice between bottled water and tap water, either filtered or unfiltered, drinking from the tap is a better choice for your wallet and for the planet. Instead of reduce, reuse and recycle, think of refill and reuse.